The wait is over. Inspectors with the Organization for the Prohibition of Chemical Weapons given access to the area of the alleged chemical attack in Duma. Samples were collected, but delayed access to the site is raising questions about the quality of the evidence and whether Syria or Russia cleared the scene. The visit comes a week after OPCW inspectors first arrived in Syria. The U.S. and France have accused Russia of blocking the investigation to buy time. Foreign Minister Lavrov, who is, who is a master of, of making these types of arguments, I mean, he would get up and stand in front of you for hours and tell you that, it, well, it could just as equally be a, you know, Martians landing from a flying saucer. You don't know that. And, you know, it, it's the kind of logic which says, you know, if they offer an alternative explanation which you can't prove is wrong, um, then that tends to, you know, whittle away at the more dominant argument. More than 40 people reportedly died in the suspected chemical attack on April 7th. The U.S., France and the U.K. retaliated by bombing several Syrian government sites. Russia and Syria have denied the use of chemical weapons. They also deny hindering the investigation. Once the samples of the suspected chemical attack are analyzed, inspectors will submit their report to the state's parties to the Chemical Weapons Convention. Depending on the findings, inspectors could make a second visit to Duma. Katia Lopez-Sodoyan, Al Jazeera.